On this James the Bike Guy, we're taking a look at the 2021 Specialized Fuse Comp. This is a 29er aggressive hardtail from Specialized, and we're going to go into some of the features and designs of this bike, talk about some of the upgrades for 2021, and then of course, we'll find out what it weighs. So while you're watching this video, be sure to leave a comment down below with what you think about the features of the bike, as well as consider subscribing. That way you can see more videos like this into the future. The heart of the 2021 Specialized Fuse Comp is of course going to be this Specialized M4 Premium Aluminum Frame. This frame set was new for 2020 and it carries into 2021. It offers a couple of neat features that really makes this stand out when you're looking at aggressive hardtails. And it's really for that rider that's maybe a bit more advanced or looking to grow their skills that wants a bike that's going to be a brawler but also climbs well and is generally a great performer. A couple of the neat features about this bike, of course, is gonna be the fact that it comes set up for 130 millimeters of suspension in the front end. It also has a real trick rear axle where it's got a sliding dropout where you could run it single speed, but that also means you can adjust the rear end of the bike from a pretty short chainstay length of 120 millimeters to a longer, more stable 135 millimeters. So it gives you quite a range of adjustment. It also allows you to run these wide 29 by 2.6 tires with tons of clearance, or it gives you the option to ride 27.5 by 3.0 tires, really giving you a wide range of what you can do with the bike. As far as geometry is concerned, the head tube angle is gonna come in at 66 and a half degrees, so fairly slack. You've got a seat tube angle at 74 degrees, which should put you in a position to be able to climb quite well. And that means in this medium frame size, you've got a reach of 440, giving the bike real nice room without being a boat. So you don't have to worry about this, not being able to get through single track, because this is still gonna be quite nimble. Fuse Comp will come in two colors. What we're looking at today is the satin, smoke, and black. So it gives almost this black on black look. It's uh, got a very matte finish to it or almost satin. And they do a nice job of smoothing out the welds. The internal cable routing is really slick on this bike and the look is quite nice. Now the other option is going to be a gloss red tent with silver flake and silver foil. I've got a picture here and that's a nice looking bike as well. Going into the drivetrain of this 2021, this is a huge upgrade for 2021. Out with the SRAM SX and in with the Shimano Deore M6100. So we've got the M6100 rear derailleur, which is going to have a clutch. So you can turn the clutch on or off. And what that's going to do is with the clutch on, it's going to really tighten up chain tension, give a much more quiet ride. Of course, you do have rubber coating over the chain stay. So even if the chain does slap a little bit, it's still going to be pretty quiet. And then you've got a super wide range 10 to 51 tooth cassette. So this is the Deor M6100 cassette. It runs on a micro spline hub and up front you're going to be running the Stout Pro crank set. This is an aluminum crank set. It's going through a threaded bottom bracket and it's going to be set up with this 30 tooth narrow wide chain ring. So you can see it's got a narrow wide profile and that's going to help with chain retention and keeping everything running smoothly. On the topic of smooth, we've got the RockShock Recon RL. This matches the bike fantastic with the black stanchions, this dark gray graphics to it. I like the look of this. And then of course you're going to have a hydraulic lockout. It's going to have certain positions to it. You can add additional compression as well as totally lock it out. And then on the other side, you're going to have air adjustment. So that's going to allow this bike to be set up exactly to your weight so you can get it dialed in and get your control just the way you want it. On the cockpit, you've got a stout aluminum stem and you've got a nice wide 31.8 handlebar. This has a little bit of rise and a little bit of sweep to it, makes for a very comfortable setup and gives you nice access to that Shimano 12 speed shifter, which you're going to have a thumb or a thumb button so you can control up or down with your thumb, or you can also do it 
with your index finger, so thumb and index. Now something I really like on the 2021 is of course gonna be the brake set. So this has the Shimano M4100 brake set. And not only the standard M4100, but it's running the four piston front caliper. So you're gonna have no concerns with stopping this bike, especially since we've got some massive rotors. So on size large or larger, it's gonna be set up with 200 millimeter front and a 180 rear. Mediums and smaller, it's got a 180 front and 160 millimeter rear. So that's gonna give this thing some crazy stopping power. And like any Shimano lever, it's gonna be very reliable and uh, Man, they just feel great. I really like that on the new Comp 2021. You also got a one by style dropper post lever. So this pushes with your thumb and it's gonna actuate a 34.9 dropper seat post. So this dropper is made by TransX. It's gonna have a hundred millimeter of range on the extra small and small. It's got 120 on this size medium tester and then size is large and extra large it's going to come with 150 millimeters of dropper travel perched onto that you've got the specialized body geometry bridge saddle it's a pretty nice hollow chromoly saddle it's got decent comfort to it and it's going to have the cutout to give pretty good blood flow for downstairs running the tires you've got a nice front and rear combo we'll start with the rear which is the specialized purgatory grid tire this is a 29 by 2.6 tire. It's got nice direction to the tread pattern here. Strong side knobs should roll quite well. It's then gonna be matched up with the specialized butcher grid tire. This is a gription compound tire. It's a very good front tire with some aggressive tread to it. Super strong side knobs, tons of grip to keep the front end planted and even better, both the front and rear tires are tubeless as well as the stout alloy SL rims that's running on the bike is also tubeless ready. So that means these 29 by 2.6 tires on 29 millimeter width internal rims are gonna be able to be set up tubeless just with some rim tape, a valve, and of course some sealant. So now that we've gone over the features and designs of this 2021 Specialized Fuse Comp, let's go ahead and find out what this bike weighs. Actual weight of the 2021 Specialized Fuse Comp comes in at 29.72 pounds. Thanks so much for watching this video on the 2021 Specialized Fuse Comp. Go ahead and let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below. While you're at it, be sure to leave a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. That way you can see more videos like this in the future.